What's up guys, this is Shambles11 and welcome to Shambles Plays episode 33. And again, we did a little vote last week. Um, I normally try and get the games out, uh, sorry, the video out on the following Monday. But uh, as you may well have all seen, I was at the Halo 5 launch. Um, so I'm a bit late, so full apologies to everybody that's been waiting for this. Um, but here is your vote winner. Um, we had four to choose from. We had... Um, Tecmo Super NBA Basketball, which unsurprisingly got zero votes. Uh, we had... Oh, yes, please. Uh, we had Spider-Man X-Men Arcade's Revenge, which got a whopping two votes. And then we had First Samurai and this, which I've got to say, tied with eight votes. Uh, but we're going for Bomb Man because there's a secret reason. Uh, I just really want to play it. Uh, this is Super Bomb Man. This is the first Bomb Man on the SNES. Uh, there were three uh, imaginatively called Super Bomb Man, Super Bomb Man 2, Super Bomb Man 3. Um, and this is what's called normal mode. This is the closest we can get to a campaign. I want to say a story, but there is no story at all. We're just blowing stuff up and killing bosses. Uh, you can kind of make your own story up, I suppose. But, you know, why bother? Well, just have fun playing the game. Um, oh, we've got to get this last guy. So, what we do on this version uh, is we have this just kind of one screen area. Uh, um, once we kill everybody, we can go to the exit. The exit is this little fella here. Uh, there are, I do believe, six, maybe seven worlds. Uh, and at stage eight of each world, <gasps> we fight a boss. Uh, 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 now, Bomb Man. Hey, cut that out. You could have taken my eye out with that. A bomb man isn't known at all for its single player. Um, in fact, it's relatively mocked for it. Uh, it it's pretty tricky. It, it's essentially a multiplayer arena deathmatch game. Uh, and before first person shooters were around, yes, folks, we are going this far back in time, all you kids. Uh, this was how we got our fix. We used to bomb our friends and make them burn. This is the first boss, so it's fairly easy. So making that into a, a story is really quite a tricky thing. I have just absolutely destroyed him. Like a bizzouse. Um And the, uh, it's fine. I actually quite enjoy this mode. I don't mind it whatsoever. Each of the worlds is kind of unique. Uh, what what we've got there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. There's 6, but I think a 7th turns up. I may be wrong about that. Uh, it may just be 6. Uh, but even 6 worlds, 8 levels on each. 48 levels. That's pretty good, you know. I hate these springy things. Please go away. I'm completely trapped. Ah, I'm invincible. Up yours. Ah, ha, 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 ha. But uh, I'm quite certain you guys haven't tuned in for this. What's pretty cool, though, is actually every uh, level has a code. So if you die, um, you will get a code at the end. Other than the boss ones, um, you can't start on a boss level. Uh, look at our two little fellas there bobbing along. I cannot remember if you can remember what they're called. I can't remember what the bomb man characters are called unless they are called. Oh, I've just pressed normal, and um, unless they're called bomber man and flommer man. I want to keep saying bob and bob, but that's a uh, bubble bubble. Bub 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 bub. I'll say that a hundred times quickly. Come on, let's uh, let's do it. There we go. Potato mode. I love potato mode. And this was really good. Uh, so you can see, you can play up to four players. Um, the computer level, we want right up to ten. Let's make it tricky. Uh, you play kind of a, a first two. It's not best of, it's first two. Uh, you can go rather up to uh, first to five wins. Wins the whole thing. But we'll stick with one. Twelve stages. Um, all had kind of their unique things. So you've got the standard one. Then some just look different with blocks in different places. Uh, jump one, you spring around all over the place. Belt one, there's a moving conveyor belt that moves your bombs around. Tunnels, obviously, are tunnels. It's hard to see where the bombs are. Are, blah, blah 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 right the way through uh, but everybody loves dual zone now dual zone you will either do really really well or really really badly um you you need to break out pretty quick because it's a race we want the boots the boots are the most important they're hugely underrated and the gold of course gives us the maximum size bomb we can have now the good thing is i won that uh which i'm quite pleased with but chances are I'm going to blow myself up because that's just... Will you lot all stop it? Right. No, that was terrible. Gotcha. Yeah, we got we got him. Oh, how did I miss that one bomb? Come here, little fella. Right, the, the trick is, if I had my timings right... 
trick is to do threes around the corner. And that, my friends, is how beating level 10 Bomberman is done. What a GD hero. <sighs> what a game, though. Um, I, I know this is kind of a cheat one, but look, we've got the victory. I think we've all won. Um, I absolutely love this Bomberman. Uh, I love all the Bombmans, but I think this is my favourite one. Bomberman, uh, the second one, the story on that... Um, and the worlds did move. You could pan across the screen if you like. Uh, they were bigger. Uh, but um, oh, let's do some warping. Um, you had to kind of hit certain blocks to open doors. And then uh, you walked through a door to exit rather than um, you know just going through. Oh, we've got the gold one straight away. We are sorted now. In all honesty, this warp one gets a little bit random. Uh, like you just end up placing bombs in the hope that someone will appear in front of oh, you definitely want the roller skates roller skates make you walk faster uh, bombs obviously allow you to place more bom bloms bloms uh, I'm not really sure what a blom is uh, boxing glove if I could remember oh that was close and he blew myself up I think we've got to be one away from it let's, let's try yeah okay boxing glove allows us to punch it out of the way um, come on oh if he turned up in the middle one then with the power of my bloms. Ah, oh, come on! Ah, oh, Jesus! Weps. We all saw that coming, didn't we? I did say in the first uh, multiplayer bit that I would blow myself up. And that's how most of us die, of course. Blue there, pushing the boundary. So these are all timed. Um, once you got to a minute, uh, oh, we're not going to see it. The walls would start slowly closing until we get to 30 seconds, and it's a really small area. Um, and if uh, nobody's won, then it's a draw, and nobody wins, and we all cry. We play another game. Hooray! Um, I absolutely love this. I spent many, many hours playing this in my youth um, with my buddy Chris. Uh, it's just a brilliant game. Um, a superb choice. I'm going to keep doing these. Uh, guys, if you watch all the way through, thank you ever so much. Give yourself three whole shambles points. Um, and leave a comment below. I've got three shambles points because I do read them and I'll give you a little thumbs up. Um, but I, I actually think this has got some of my favourite multiplayer levels in... What's Bomb Zone? I think Bomb Zone isn't anything special. Let's play this while I do a little outro. Um, I'm going to keep up doing the um, votes. You guys have responded really well to them. I think uh, if I gave you all of my games... Oh, random bombs drop down. Um then we would just be playing the same games but I like kind of giving you a choice of a few games um, or oh, we don't want those skulls I don't think I mentioned the skulls make bad things happen um, they can make you uh, drop all your bombs instantly really long fuses really short fuses uh, just stuff to catch you out basically uh, you don't want them well done blue um, but yeah I'm gonna keep up with these votes I really enjoy them I'm gonna try and stick to the format of doing it on a Friday and get the video up on a Monday if I can um, Everything, of course, is going completely haywire again because I've got another new job and it's just kind of getting stuff uh, uh, sorted for days off and blah, 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 blah. But anyway, that's for me to worry about. Uh, guys, thank you so, so much for watching. Um, please do come uh, and find me on Twitter at Shambles11. Um, make sure you're following my Vine as well, vine.co forward slash Shambles11 because I put the votes up on there too. Um, Leave me a comment below uh, if you like this kind of thing. If you've enjoyed this, please do let me know. I do appreciate it. So does my ego. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Till next time.